Hello and welcome to the new Airtronics podcast seen and heard on the Airtronics YouTube channel and here at Airtronics.net. Hi, my name is Craig Kaplan and I'm a product manager with Airtronics. Today I'd like to tell you about our new Airtronics M11X radio system and also to welcome you to our new podcast. The M11X radios have just started to arrive. It is the next generation of the very popular M11 radio that Airtronics has had for a number of years and has also won numerous awards. The M11X compared to its predecessor is not only faster, it has more features, it is lighter, better balanced, and gives the racers and future racers all the benefits that they would need out of a radio system to make them successful. One of the neat features about the M11X which a lot of people uh, will enjoy is how fast the radio system is. While numerous people say their radio system company is the fastest, i uh, just like to let you know and to clarify, the M11X radio is the fastest car radio on the market, hands down. Uh, what that means is as soon as you give it input to your steering or to your throttle, whatever input you do give, your car is going to respond immediately. That means that it might involve a little bit of getting used to as the radio operates so fast, but be assured you will enjoy it. Uh, one of the other neat features that this radio has versus the old system, it does have more features. Not only does it have all the features of the great M11 radio, it has even more. It has numerous fail-safe settings, whether you're running nitro or electric. It also has a fail-safe setting depending on your receiver voltage. Uh, you can also set fail safes on all channels and you can set it to either have a neutral point, a custom point, uh, you can even have it set for just 20%, uh, whatever value you choose. One of the other nice things about it is it has a custom menu built into it where if you decide not to scroll through all three menu screens, you can at least have all of your favorite features on one particular screen and just advance back and forth through that one viewing area so that way you don't spend extra time trying to navigate the menu. The other nice things about the radio, it's got the 2.4 integrated system into it. Uh, there's no worry about a module in the back of it, something to fall out. The antenna folds down nicely, easily stores into the Airtronics radio case that's designed for it, so you don't have to remove the module and worry about damaging anything. The other neat thing about it uh, about the M11X which has been updated is the battery system in it uses a six cell nickel metal hydride battery. This radio system operates more efficiently uh, therefore it uses a smaller battery pack which makes it again lighter, easier to use and a better ergonomic balance. Uh, the radio like I said is a six cell nickel metal hydride. It will come, the radio system will come with a small peak detection charger to charge that up through the little charge jack in the handle here. Of course, aftermarket batteries can be used if you choose to make it even lighter with a two cell LiPo, but for the time being, the radio itself, even with the nickel metal hydride pack in it, is extremely light and most users will find it suitable for them. The other nice thing about the M11X radio, it has a new style receiver with it. Uh, this new receiver combined with the M11X uses our latest FHSS3 technology. That is the latest technology to be used at this time. As you can see from the antenna, it is a little bit longer than previous systems. That helps enable you to get the best reception possible wherever you are, whether you're in a car, a boat, any type of, uh, any type of other surface use vehicle that you're using. Uh, it's also very small. Uh, like I said, very low profile. It will fit into most receiver boxes as well as most applications and areas. More features about the radio is, as with the previous M11, it has adjustable spring rates for your steering and for your throttle. It also has a new setup now for your steering, which is a variable adjustment rate. Even though your steering turns all the way left, all the way right, as in with most radios, you can actually limit it to turn just a little bit and yet still get all of your steering adjustment that you would need even with a small amount of steering input. Uh, another nice thing about it is it is switchable. Uh, as with previous M11 users, you can undo a couple screws, take your whole top end, rotate it around, and that way you can have an adjustable left-handed radio system which is very convenient because that way it suits all drivers. 
Uh, again, there are so many features of this radio, it's impossible to say in one podcast. Please check into airtronics.net uh, or check future podcasts for more information when we get into specific details on this, as well as just the numerous adjustments you can do and fine tune for your own vehicles. Thank you for watching. Again, my name is Craig Kaplan with Airtronics, and hope to see you next time. Choose Airtronics and get the advantage. More Airtronics product information as well as a list of authorized Airtronics dealers can be found at Airtronics.net. Visit our Airtronics.net website and our YouTube channel for product updates and podcast announcements. Thank you for watching.